Hey, how's it going guys? Matt here from Toasty DIY and I'm here with a very quick video to show you how you can fix your Windows install. Whether you're having blue screens, random freezes, crashes, just overall a sluggish experience in Windows that wasn't the case before with your PC, you can do this simple fix to potentially fix the problem without having to reinstall your entire operating system because we do know that, well, while be it that is a better solution and we'll pretty much guarantee you'll fix any sort of Windows corruption issues, it is very time consuming consuming having to reinstall all your programs get everything set up the way you like it and I know a lot of you just don't want to deal with that especially you PC gamers having to reinstall a bunch of games so we're gonna go ahead and try something before we go to that option and that is using the command prompt and using SFC scan now so all you have to do is go to the desktop open up whatever search bar you have right here and type in command prompt. And what you're gonna do is, oh wait, I forgot to do something. We're gonna have command prompt, but we're going to run it as administrator. Right click, run as administrator, hit yes. Wait for my display capture to come back here. And from here, you're going to copy and paste the command that I have in the description, SFC slash scan now, hit enter. And now what this is going to do is go ahead and scan all the system files that Windows actually has access to and make sure there's no corruptions or just commonly mistaken problems with the operating system. And then if it does find some missing files or corrupted files, it'll go ahead and download them and fix them. And in theory, it should fix some common issues that may cause blue screens, crashes, freezes, and things like that. As you can see, it's taking a little bit to complete. I actually just did this on my PC, I would say about a week ago because my PC was having issues locking up randomly and it did find Find some missing files that downloaded it and as of right now I have not had any issues on a Windows install that's been running for about three years now it's been upgraded I believe from Windows 7 to Windows 10 um, and it's been working perfectly fine ever since and I've had all the same files and everything so we're gonna let this complete see if it finds any errors it might actually find some errors still you never really know but I have a feeling it's probably gonna say everything is fine for my PC but for you if you download some files and it finds errors that's a good thing start using your PC as normal and see if that fixed the problem Problem. If that doesn't work, you're probably looking at a new Windows install or, d or diving into some more troubleshooting of your PC hardware. Um, but Windows install is, well, good to go. And as you can see right here, no integrity violations. Everything is working fine because I did fix this already and it seems to work fine. So yeah, definitely consider trying this. If you guys have any questions, let me know down below. But once again, be sure to run it as administrator, copy and paste from the description, and uh, you should be good to fix your PC. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this very quick guide on how to fix your PC if you're having any errors or things like that. Let me know down below if you had any issues or if this actually fixed your problem i really want to know um and yeah that's about it guys be sure to like comment subscribe and we'll see you guys in the next one